Hey guys, this is Auto Odometer, and I have some faded black trim here on the rear of my Toyota Sequoia, and we're going to try two different methods to be able to restore this trim. Just by looking at it, you can tell it's pretty dirty. So we do have some cleanup to do before we apply some of this trim restorer. So first step, we're going to clean this plastic trim with a vacuum, cleaning up any leaves or dirt or debris. Once all the loose debris is removed by the vacuum, you're going to want to take some alcohol or some surface cleaner to be able to remove some of the fine, more fine dirt that the vacuum can't get. You are also going to want to let it dry before you apply your plastic trim restorer. Even after just wiping down half of the trim here, you can see how much the alcohol is actually wiping off. Now this is something you want to do for sure, just so whenever you apply the plastic trim cleaner, you have the best adhering possible. You can either let it air dry or do what I did and take a box fan and let it blow on the trim. Once it's completely dry, you can do a couple more alcohol applications to be able to make sure it's thoroughly clean. Take a look at these four different applications of the alcohol and see how much dirt was actually pulled up. Once you're satisfied with how clean the trim is, you're going to want to apply some tape. Now, in my case, I applied the tape in the center so you can see a difference between the transmission fluid and the back to black restorer. I also put it around the edges to be able to fully protect against the paint and clear coat. All right, so let's get started with the manual transmission fluid. Now, as far as I know, it doesn't matter if you use automatic or manual transmission fluid. In my case, I applied the manual. You're going to want to get yourself a clean terry cloth, and then be careful because this manual transmission fluid is actually pretty runny compared to the trim restorer. Make sure you can get into all the grooves depending on which type of trim you're restoring. You're going to want to go back and forth and definitely do a couple applications and push it in as best as you can. Once you're all done, take a look at it, and man, that definitely looks really good. Compared to the faded plastic, that is much better. Let's go ahead and apply this back to black restorer. Get yourself a new clean terry cloth for the new application. Now, there's a couple directions on the back of this bottle. You want to make sure you shake it up well, and you apply it to a cool, clean surface. This trim restorer is much thicker than the manual transmission fluid, so it's going to be a little bit easier to apply it. Just like before, make sure you get into all the grooves, buff it out, and make sure that there's no visible trim restorer sitting there. Once you're done buffing it all out, step back and make sure you didn't miss any spots. Now if we compare the manual transmission fluid to the black trim restorer, at first glance, the transmission fluid definitely looks like it's much thicker. It's a deeper, blacker application. However, I do want to show you what it looks like one week afterwards. Even though right after the application, the manual transmission fluid looks really good compared to the trim restore, we're looking to make sure that this stuff lasts. Once I take the tape off, you can definitely tell that the transmission fluid is far superior to the plastic trim restore. Let's fast forward one week later. You can definitely tell that the manual transmission fluid has significantly faded to what it looked like before. In some of the grooves, you can still see that the dark black areas are still pretty deep, but over here on the trim restore, even though it's not as a deep black as I wish, it hasn't faded as much as the manual transmission fluid. So what are we going to do? What I want to do is take an entire bottle of back to black trim restore and apply it to a completely faded trim. Now, since we've already applied some trim restore and transmission fluid on this trim right here on my Sequoia, I do have some other vehicles that we can definitely try this on. I do have a couple runner boards on my 4Runner and my Sequoia here, as well as on my BMW, I have a couple trim pieces that I can try. So if you do have any suggestions, if anything works better than transmission fluid or better than the back to black trim restore, go ahead into the comments and let me know. If you like this video, leave a thumbs up, and as always, thanks for watching.